Howdy folks and good morning and welcome to the day we do the car, the door cart. I'm here at Car Zone Interior. In Chiras, this is the guy that did my uh, 126 for me a long time ago. You can see some very, very nice cars here. But yes, this is the day, the day. Now, apart from wrapping, what is another option that you can use to fix up stuff like this, which has gotten really, really bad? Yeah, I used, uh, I used duct tape to actually cover it because it was so horrible. Now, of course, one option is to wrap all the doors, but if you are if you don't have the budget for that, there are other options. And today we're gonna to explore the other options in so far as getting the doors done up. As you know, I've done the seat already. And so now it's up to these guys to see what they can do for the door. It's in really bad condition. Like I told you before, this car was very much a solo use car. So all the wear and tear is on the driver's side, passenger side, rear, rear side is fine. So lots to be done. This is the before and i'm really excited to see what they can do here let me just show you a bit of uh car zone interior they also do exteriors as you can see some high-end cars some middle-end cars some very high-end cars and also uh body work so lots of stuff that can be done here but today i'm here just for the door cards as you can see from the passenger side the door cards are actually fine maybe it needs a bit of a cleanup but that's it so, very excited to see what Kazun Interior can do. I will leave uh, the address in the description. It's at uh, Taman Shemlin Pukasa. So, let's see. Let's see what, the, what they can do to make it better. Okay, stay tuned. I'm excited. I hope you are too. So, the uh, rolling restoration of the 210 continues. Oh yeah, somebody was asking about these wraps. You can still find them on Shopee, yeah? Just uh, search steering cover, steering wrap. You should still be able to find it. Okay, stay tuned. More to come. Okay, this is not mine, obviously, but you can see what has been done here. This is uh, a door cart from another car that has been refurbished. So, and it's not wrapped. This is gonna be, this is a spray. Interesting, very interesting. I also spied something very nice at the back, which, I, which wasn't this, although that's very nice. Would you like to go see it? I'll show it to you in a second. Let's go have a look. I spied it there. This, this is a Toyota 800 Sport. Ooh, nice Jeep. G-Wagon. And check that out. Got an E30 there, a Fiat 500, and this a Toyota 800 Sport. Very, very cool. So, all the stuff here is done by hand, yeah? All the cars in there being done by hand. Very, very cute. My friend Alex had one of these. So yeah, metal work, body work, body kit work. Anybody want to guess what this is? I have no idea. Yeah, lovely Jeep wagon. And a lovely Jeep Wrangler. Cool. So, okay, stay tuned. We're going to start work on the 210 in a moment. That's Kelvin. Right, so here we are at the uh, back room and the door card is already out. So as you can see, it's moving, removing all the components from the back of the door card before they actually make the improvements on it. Very excited to see what's gonna happen on this. Stay tuned. Let's another 
door cut that's being done that's in really bad condition so they have to get rid of all the this is a full wrap so they have to get rid of all the, the junk first before they begin now. this is just going to be refurbished with uh, their special paint so stay tuned on that Now oh, this is nice. This is the waiting area of Kazon Interior. You can see they've won a lot of awards, trophies up there, and uh, a very cool seating arrangement. I, I I'm not sure if these are being refurbished or they were swapped out for captain seats, maybe. But uh, yeah, they look very very comfortable. A very very. Uh, car inspired waiting room with all, with all the stuff around that. that's a huge trophy very cool they do a lot of mpvs as well as uh, supercars and and all classic cars as well there's my there's my old lady being driven out so that this maserati can go out nice I bet this is Kelvin's car. <laughs> right, so we're kind of midway through. Uh, the handle, the handle needs to be rewrapped. So that couldn't use the paint. So they're rewrapping that that the grip handle part, which is over there. Over here, they're adding a bit more sponge to where my elbow would sit over there. And I, if I'm not mistaken, what they're going to do is they're going to add a little uh, a layer of leather, same color, original color. A little layer of leather there before they spray it because the leather part has already worn out a little bit so yeah something different rather than rewrapping the whole the whole um, door card like what you see over there what they're gonna do is just one part so those of you on a budget like me have another option uh, besides rewrapping the whole door card which will cost a lot more of course yes I'm very interested to see what's gonna transpire from this everything here is done by hand the stitching everything is done by hand so give them some time to finish it they also do spraying yeah uh, they, they, uh, they were spraying a whole car over there and check this out it's a Z it's a gorgeous Z inside there they wrap the uh, seats as you can see not gonna go inside there but basically they can rewrap any seat there's a beautiful jag here so any part of your car that needs to be done can be done here. When was the last time you saw a Nissan Stegea? Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous. And Z4 as well. Oh, beautiful. Wagon life, baby. Wagon life. Folks, so we're almost there. As you can see, this is my grab handle. Now, the areas where it had to be wrapped were this because there's no point spraying something as high impact as this with the amount of time that you're going to be grabbing it and, you know, opening the door and all that. So, better to just wrap this part however this is new they're putting on an additional piece of leather on this high wear area here and then they're just gonna touch up this this part and then spray the whole thing this is very interesting a new uh, an idea so that even if you do rewrap your door you can actually put another piece here same material same color on this high wear and tear area of course it's gonna be lipped in so that it just gives a little bit more strengthening, a little bit more buffer for this area. Nice. Stay tuned. More to come. So the final touches, folks. Okay. They need to sand it down a little bit. Again, I'm not doing this part. This part just needs to be clean. But they got to sand it down before they do a little bit of spraying. So this is the... Uh, new leather part for the high wear and tear area my idea actually very cool so we're almost done as you can see Getting there, getting there. This is where they do all the door cards. Check out this beautiful little Fiat. 
I love it. It's awesome. It's got a very distinctive smell. I wish I could transmit smells through my GoPro, but I can't. But it's got a very distinctive smell because coconut husk is actually used in the seats at the back. Yes, highly flammable coconut husk. What did we care about flammability back then? But yeah, this is like a full ground up restoration. Super cool! Three classics in a row. Nice. Shall we have a look? I'm not sure what car this is, but Curiosity has got the better of me. Yeah, E34. Lovely. Very, very nice. Slowly getting done up, I guess. The owner actually brought in a car cover. Just to make sure it's not, it doesn't get dusty. E30, Toyota 800 Sport, Fiat 500. 600, sorry, the 500 is different back. Super cool, so yeah, stay tuned. Almost done. And that's it, folks. We are done. Check it out. Yes, finally. The door cards that are as nice as the driver's seat. <laughs> it's taken a while, but very well worth the wait. So happy. So yeah, check it out, guys. And uh, come on over to Car Zone Interior. Over here in Chiras, I'll leave the, uh, the, the, uh, the address in the description. Come and have a look. See what they can do for you. Or give Kelvin a call. Or an SMS, I will leave his number as well. Thank you for watching, folks. Like I said, it was gonna be fun and it was fun watching them do this. Really nice. As you know, I love to see a car coming back to life again. And uh, it's been very rewarding with the 210. We're not done yet, there's still stuff to do. So stay tuned. Lots, lots more to come. Take care, y'all. Thanks for watching. Bye. Oh, that looks good.